this is the pixel 9 pro xl and this is the iphone 16 pro max and if you confuse there i totally get that this is the most iphone like pixel ever it has flat sides and the only big visual difference is the camera system on the back but which one should you go for and what are the pros and cons of each one hey guys ali here with 5m tech and just in terms of size both are big phones but the iPhone is a bit slimmer and I prefer that now in the hand both feel nice thanks to those chamfered edges. They weigh about the same but the iPhone is a bit more puff heavy. Now it also gets a slightly bigger screen 6.9 inch versus 6.8 inches on the pixel. But honestly that's barely noticeable. I do like these super slim bezels on the iPhone they look very cool especially if you use, use your phone without a case. The screen on the Pixel however can get slightly brighter outdoors while the iPhone has another advantage it can drop to just one knit at night. So it's easier on the eyes and bed. Now most of you are probably curious which one has the better camera. The camera specs are really similar 48 megapixel main camera on the iPhone 50 megapixel 1 pixel 48 megapixel ultra wide camera on both and a 5x zoom camera 12 megapixel one on the iPhone and 48 megapixels on the pixel but what about the photos well during the day the iPhone almost always captures brighter photos while the pixel goes for a darker look I like the pixel style better that's personal preference when you look closer detail is also a bit rough and artificially sharpened on the iPhone while the pixel gives you more natural softer detail and at night these two flip rolls a bit the pixel now consistently takes brighter pictures while the iphone goes for darker shots honestly it's a toss up between the two at night the pixel looks a bit cleaner but because of how bright the photos are they almost no longer feel like night shots at all and the iphone also could do better with the processing some photos look bad because of its excessive sharpening the Pixel comes with a 5000 mAh battery while the iPhone has a nearly 4700 capacity. We ran our 3 in-house battery tests on the lightest web browsing test the Pixel got a score of nearly 90-19 hours while the iPhone lasted way longer at nearly 22 hours and 40 minutes that's a big difference for YouTube video streaming the iPhone lasted a full hour more more than the pixel with nearly 10 hours and a half and for 3d gaming the iphone once again had the upper hand lasting 12 hours and 4 minutes exactly 2 hours longer than the pixel overall we estimate that the iphone 16 pro max has a screen time of around 8 hours and 30 minutes compared to 7 hours and 18 minutes on the pixel Charging however is a bit faster than the pixel we measured that the iPhone can charge at a speed of about 27 watt which is about the same as the past few iPhones while the pixel is just a bit faster in real life we measured that in half an hour get 63% back on the pixel and 57% back on the iPhone. A full charge takes 1 hour and 23 minutes on the pixel and 1 hour and 42 minutes on the iPhone. Finally we could talk about AI but with the iPhone there is just not much to say about it. The Pixel already has cool features like Gemini built right in and photo tricks like add me and photo reimagine and it's had other features like voice recording summaries for a while. The iPhone is still expected to get them later on even then the iPhone will only support one language English well the Pixel works with a bunch of other languages so which one should you go for? Well, if photography is your calling and you want the best battery life, the iPhone still feels a bit ahead. But if you want the latest and coolest AI tricks, the Pixel is the one that has them. And which one are you picking? Let me know in the comments and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next.